Hello, my thrift friends. Welcome to another episode of Good Game Grabs. My name is Ray. I am a full-time reseller on eBay. My wife is a part-time seller in her antique mall booth. And we, combined with all this lovely stuff behind us, make up the duo that is Good Game Grabs. But today we are going into some garage sale footage. We've been really doing well at garage sales this year so far. It's been so nice to have such a expansive knowledge of different things uh, as the years go on, as we've been resellers. I feel like we finally hit stride to where we finally can know how to make money on basically every single sort of category. Like if it's just general merchandise, like electronics, we know if it's glassware, Tupperware, we know if it's clothing, we know. So it's really nice. Uh, but yeah, we're going to roll into some beautiful garage sale footage. Hope you guys enjoy it. And don't forget to, th to hit that sub button down below. What's up, y'all? It is a Saturday morning, about a few minutes until 8 a.m. We are at our first garage sale of the day. And boy, do we have like a pretty stacked lineup. You know, we've got maybe five sales all within the vicinity of a couple miles of our house, which that's always a great time because I don't have to do like any searching for new sales or anything like that. It's all pointed out. I've got it mapped out. Let's get at the day. Um, anything 80s, 90s, pop culture related, if you got that. Um, uh, a couple DVDs. Cool, yeah. Anything, uh, yeah, anything electronic related. Maybe we sold some, well, you know what? I have a stereo. Oh, really? An old stereo? Yeah. Do you have any like old video game stuff by chance? Yeah. Were, were you the guy that sent me a note about video stuff? Okay. Nope. Yeah. <laughs> you know, nope. You know, oh. oh, well, thank you so much. Wow. Thank you. How are you guys doing? We're doing great. Good, good. Good to see you. Yes. Okay. Are you guys going to come too? Do you want to come? Yeah. Oh. Okay, Linda. Yeah, hey, and this is something from Debbie and I. Sure. Yeah. I have this lovely vintage Star Wars t shirt. Oh, well, I'll take a look at that. That's kind of cool. It's got a little. It's not brand new or in perfect condition, gotcha. but three bucks? Uh, you can think it over. I'm probably going to pass on it. Thank you. Thank you, though. Okay, so I've got, got 13 got, together all together. Would you do $10 if I bought all three? Um, yes, yes, yes. Oh. Um, sure. All right. Sure. Sounds good. All right. It's like throwing in the free Tupperware. Oh, that's right. <laughs> got to make the wife happy. <laughs> oh, well, here. I got it. Okay. Good deal. If you, if you got change for, if we run short. Yeah. Okay. Good deal. <laughs> Didn't want to take all your your small stuff. Thank you guys so much. Thank you. Thanks for Alrighty, have a good one. I think that might be the first time I've seen the actual Belveda container for vintage Tupperware. There's all sorts of like cool niche things that Tupperware did back in the day. And uh, that's one of them. We got it for, you know, basically for free with the two other items, both sealed on the other ones. I'm pretty happy. That's a first good little score. Let's go. morning guys it's going. it's going
something exciting or just yeah. out. <laughs> this kind of stuff. <laughs> yeah. Would you guys do uh, three on the controller? Yeah. All right, cool. All right. Oh, I don't have. Oh, you don't have anybody, a change? Does anybody have $2? Uh, from that? $2. Actually, I might have. Hold on, let me see how many ones I have here. I thought I only had two. Oh, oh all right. Perfect. All right, perfect. There we go. All thank right. you so much, guys. Right, thank you. So that red Xbox One controller really kind of caught my eye because... I haven't really seen that one that much. I don't think it's a special edition or anything. It might be. We're going to check it out when we get home. But for three bucks, it needs a little cleaning. Why not? We'll make some bucks on it. Good morning. Hello, how are you? Doing pretty good. Good morning. There was a lot of stuff in that garage that I could have probably bought for personal use, but we're not here to spend money. We're here to make money and uh, we definitely have some more sales to go. So I don't mind striking out on the third sale of the morning. Strikeout number two. I really, really, really wanted those cameras. I was making a deal with myself. If they had the batteries in there and I had to buy a charger, fine. I'll take a shot, try to get a deal on them, but they didn't even have batteries. I'm not going to go out of my way to buy batteries and chargers for cameras I know don't possibly work. It's like Krampus and Butter. Like, uh, we don't really know why we're here, but, <laughs> but it looks cool. Good. Find the good stuff. Find the good stuff. Find the good stuff. <laughs> Is this all over the house, or yeah, we're in the garage. There's a basement. Okay, what's in the basement? Tools. Uh, all the tools are in the garage. Okay. 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 Anyway, you can. Yeah, I think there's also boxes at the front that you can use to hold things. Or Where's the basement located at? So if you go down and around, like oh, you so go down and outside, there's one that you can get through here. Thank you. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, how are you? Doing pretty good, doing pretty good, how are you? Here, and just put this 
sticker on it with your name so we know it's yours. For free? I did not. I, uh, for some reason, I lost my pen. And a baseball bat, do you think? It's, uh, it's on the end. There it is. Thank you. That's a good price. Yeah. Okay, so I need to write you the paper. You got, you got it. I got to go. Do you have more than one pen? Uh, Here. Not the one. I just got to mark one. Hey, are you still up there? You right there? I am. Okay. Where are you still up there? Yep. <laughs> you got the right kind of job. Though, so. Yes, I, I like the flexibility. Yep. The other best thing about your job is you don't have to. No, no. Oh. Oh no, I'm right here. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Oh, right. Right here. Right here. Right here. Okay. Yep. <laughs> two freebies. Three. Yeah, this one and that one were freebies. And got then it. those two right so, there. I think there was a buck on, on okay. album. So now we're 50. Now we're 50, yeah. Okay. Five. What did they give you a tool? They're all one dollar it said. Oh, six seven. Are these yours, Katie? Yeah. Eight. I thought they were supposed oh, to be about tools. Then, uh, four dollars for those dollar fifty. Yep. That she stuck my name on. Oh, Susie, are you Susie? Chicken. Yeah. Okay. That's me. So that's so twelve. Could, seven. Okay. Eight. Did we get this too? Uh, Thank you. Nine. Yeah. I didn't get that. Oh, that's mine. Oh, you know what? I don't need a bag or anything for the VCR. No. Okay. No. No. Appreciate you. Not a problem. Thanks for buying some stuff. Thank you. <laughs> I know how it goes. <laughs> Thank All right. you. There you are. All right, thanks. Have a great day. You too. Thank you. Um, I arguably got the best stuff of that sale for free, which is kind of funny. Uh, we're gonna go home and test that VCR immediately though. I need to know. I need to know if my free VCR was worth the money. Morning guys. All right, I think I'm ready to settle up with you guys. Would you guys be willing to do seven bucks? How much is that? Well, it's, you had five and five and then 50 cents a piece on the shirts. Eight? Sure. That worked.
Alrighty, thank you guys so much. I was wondering when I was gonna pick up some clothing stuff today. Uh, those two pairs of American Eagle jeans were in pretty solid shape, like really, really solid shape. And the two uh, long sleeve shirts made in USA, I'm gonna use those to make some Good Game Grabs merch. The, the logo really should pop on both of those. Morning guys. Hey, how you doing? doing good. How much for the guitar here? Guitar. Six bucks. Alright, deal. Deal. Make sure it's in there. Yeah, I was gonna say, <laughs> as long as everything's in there. <laughs> my kids never played with it. Gotcha. They were too young. Gotcha. I think it just sat brand new in the box. Brand new in the box. <laughs> yeah, I was like, yeah, man, it might, be. might even have to cut the tape on it. Right. Oh my gosh. Yeah. It's brand new. It's never been used. Sweet. Awesome, man. <laughs> Would you guys throw in the tech decks for a couple extra bucks? What's kid got marked on there? Six. I didn't put that on there, bro. Brielle did. Tell you what. <laughs> Three bucks on it be all right. All right, that's fine. Ten yeah. bucks even. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. We'll be ten. Uh, or actually, no, I, I, what am I talking about? There you go, just laying it right to him. Okay, perfect. Thank you. And then you, guys, the can you guys can uh, divvy it up amongst yourselves. <laughs> well, that was an unexpected sale. So I was driving home from that other one we just went to, popped in, saw this one, and yeah, that guitar was like literally brand new in the box. The box is torch, but that's a pretty good deal for five bucks. So I'm here in the dirty dungeon. I'm testing out this guitar because I'm excited. It's a great deal. I can't wait. I pull it out and I'm like, huh, it's got some like crusties on it and stuff. I'm like, that's kind of weird. And then I'm like, let's check and see if there's batteries in the battery tray. There was, there was also no game inside of the box. That should have been a telltale sign. I didn't even see it though, because cardboard does cover it inside the box. And so, yeah, this was most definitely used. And then on top of that, cause you know, I was like, Hey, you know what? If it is used, whatever, it's still worth a great deal at, you know, five bucks or whatever. And I break it out. I hook it up to my Xbox 360 over here in the testing station. And literally none of the buttons work. The up down does not work. I have no words. I have no words. I got taken for a ride on that one, guys. Uh, you know, it is possible to tear this thing apart and try to repair it. But, you know, as you guys know, as resellers, time is money, and maybe I'll find some time in the future to dig into it. But for right now, we are $5 in the hole. With that blunder out of the way, let's go ahead and set up our free VCR, though. Fingers crossed that one is going to bring us back into the green. All right, y'all, here goes nothing. I mean, we do have power, obviously. All right, that's good, that's good. Let's actually put this on the right thing. Okay, let's grab a VHS. Lion King, a classic. Oh, that was buttery. Yo, that was buttery. Do we have it on the wrong output? Okay, I had it on the wrong output, guys. Let's see here. I don't know what to do here. Timer programs were lost due to power interruption. Reset program, exit action. Okay, we're gonna need the remote for this, I'm assuming. I don't know what the heck was going on with that, but I just turned the power off and turned it back on and now we're completely fine. So yeah, it does play. It does fast forward. Let's see if it does rewind. Oh, it sure does. All right, let's go ahead and stop it. 
eject. Uh, oh, that sounded that sounded a little sketchy at first. Bam. Clean. Let's go. Let's freaking go. Best item of the day for absolutely free. Well, now that we have a W and an L, let's go through the rest of the garage sale haul. First thing up was this Trivial Pursuit Rolling Stones Collector's Edition. I would typically run away from stuff like this all day, every day, but it was brand new sealed. And for five bucks, you know, I was like, heck yeah, I'm in. I don't think the, cr the comps were that crazy on it. I think they were somewhere around 25 bucks. Uh, but for something that's easy to list, easy to ship, all that good stuff, couldn't pass it up. Same sale, I got that Velveeta container and you guys saw the comps were about 10 bucks. Uh, we'll probably throw this in the booth for 10 or 12 bucks and you know, basically eliminate the, the need to ship something like this and it should sell uh, relatively quickly. And we can always throw it on, up on eBay if it doesn't. And the last thing from that sale was the Simpsons 16th season sealed. I was surprised at this one because most Simpsons stuff does not go for very much, but brand new sealed, great, you know, Great comps. I mean, it was anywhere from like 30 to 40 bucks. Uh, even pre-owned, guys. Be on the lookout for season 16 pre-owned. This one is still going for pretty good. Ended up picking that up that Xbox One controller. Uh, it does come with a dongle to plug it into a PC, so I can test it pretty easily. We don't have an Xbox One. So yeah, we'll go ahead and test this on PC. But I mean, all of the joysticks feel really good. All the buttons up top feel good. So I honestly have no uh, qualms that this should work. Uh, it just needs to be cleaned up a little bit, which isn't a big deal. But yeah, I was on the money. You guys saw the comps. Uh, this is like sort of a more limited edition controller. So, you know, 25, 30 bucks all day. The other part of that Guitar Hero guitar uh, sale was these tech decks. Uh, got these for five bucks, got the guitar for five bucks. We paid 10 and uh, yeah, I don't know. I think I'm gonna probably just keep all of these for my personal collection. I just think tech decks are kind of fun, like part of my childhood that I didn't really get a lot of. So I think it's just me like wanting to collect uh, stuff that I never really got too much of back in the day. I might sell a couple of these, you know, in a lot if they, if they deem like they're cool enough or something, but probably just gonna end up keeping all these good personal item for five bucks. The one sale we got clothing at, I got a couple long sleeve t-shirts that were both made in USA heavyweight cotton by Pluma. I've never heard of the brand, but heavyweight cotton, they feel good. And for 50 cents, I'm not passing these up. Um, you know, oh God, maybe we tie dye one, you know, like the white one or something cool. And then the, uh, the logo, the Good Game Grabs logo should really pop on this blue one. Uh, stay tuned guys though. Again, we are rolling out the merch very soon. We're going to basically get some back designs on a lot of the stuff that we've been doing and then we'll go ahead and roll out what we got. Two pairs of American Eagle jeans. These are the super stretch, I think boot cut. What were these? Kick boot, super stretch kick boot. Um, again, you know, just a really solid mall brand jean. I don't see, you know, anything over than like, you know, maybe 15 bucks each of these. Uh, but, you know, I mean, we paid eight bucks for, you know, both these and the shirts. I'd say that's a win pretty much. I have been looking everywhere for that little radio that I got, that little Emerson radio I got for free from the sale along with the VCR. Couldn't find it. But I have to imagine it's probably like an eight to ten dollar radio. Nothing crazy. And I think that's it, guys. I think the important lesson here is to check the free box, <laughs> especially if there is a cool VCR player in there. If you guys enjoyed content just like this, be sure to hit that sub button down below. We really appreciate you guys watching, sharing the channel, all that good stuff. Uh, it's just been great to you know build a community around uh, not only reselling, but also nerd collecting and just retro nostalgia and all that good stuff. So thank you guys so much. Please hit that like button if you like the video. It costs you nothing to do. We really appreciate it, but we will see you guys later on the next grab. Bye for now.